this is how I know God is real. Can't nobody tell me God not real and make me believe that. I know God is real. I know manifesting is real. I know that I am powerful and I can achieve everything that I want, regardless of how long it takes, regardless of who laughs, because I have faith bigger than a mustard seed. But I want to share this with y'all. I was just looking at this and laughing and crying. Um, one year ago, I wrote this on Facebook. This July 3rd, 2022, I put, I want to write the City Girls a couple of songs. It only got about 331 likes, two shares, some crying faces. But y'all know one thing about the Peach Patch. They gonna encourage me. They gonna be with my bullshit. <laughs> so they was like, just write for Carisha. JT always come correct. And she do. I can't believe JT like my friend. My sister, sister, we so ghetto. My sister, sister wrote, let them revamp hoeing and going. Hoeing <laughs> Ho and going is a song that I wrote years ago. And they still play it to this day in the strip club. <laughs> in the strip clubs in Tampa. I'm so ashamed of hoeing and going. Don't go look for it. Mm-mm, mind your bitch. But it was this comment for me that had me laughing and crying. She wrote, do it. I put, I don't know how I would actually get, th get to them, though. I got some five songs in mind for them. They say, do it, trust, put it out, and it will get to them somehow. Social media, you got this. Where there is a will, there is a way. You don't seem like a quitter to me. You can speak it like you did with Rod Wave. You got this, girl. Because y'all know I love Rod Wave. I'm going to do a song with Rod Wave. Rod Wave is doing a song with me. He don't know it yet. He might think I'm crazy. People laugh at me all the time when I tell them that. Oh, me and Rod Wave, we doing a song together. They be like, you know Rod Wave? I be like, nah, but we still doing a song together. That's going to happen. I don't know when it's going to happen, but Rod Wave, you doing a song with me. But anyway, <laughs> that's why they were saying that because I said I was going to meet Rod Wave and I met him before my birthday. I was like, I'm going to meet Rod Wave on my birthday. Went all the way to Savannah, did not meet him. And then he did that gas uh, gas station gas giveaway last year, and I met him, and I got to touch him. That was one of the best experiences in my life. That's why sometimes I let people touch me depending on the energy, because when I touched Rod Wave, I got to see, like, this is just a human. He just like me. If he could do it, I could do it. If he can have his dream, I could have my dream. And right in for the City Girls is one of my dreams. Like, I have music. I have, like, raunchy rap so i got seven kids it's raunchy over here <sighs> i can't believe this look let me show y'all some more so the peach patch was just encouraging me this is a year ago if you find out who their producer is you can send it to them or you can send it to the dj inbox them their booking information on um instagram their emails or uh, they bio or email p a coach like and JT, just like my music, just off of TikTok. Just like found me on TikTok randomly. I done gave up on this. I gave up on this dream of like writing for the city girls. Just like, whatever. Maybe I do suck. Like some people say, like, life is life. -ing. Whatever. And look at this. I ain't saying I'm going to write a song for them. I know JT don't need me to write a song for her. But I'm just saying, like, they like my music. She likes my music. She likes my music. Thank you so much, JT. I had forgot about this dream.